Hey everyone, welcome back to Freak Motion. Today we are going to see how to create paper unfold effect inside of After Effects, or you can call it the Great Ali Abdul effect. Recently, this effect is going so viral all over the social media. So I thought I should share the technique with all of you. All right, let's get a composition first. Let's call it Paper Effect. Okay, and for this kind of animation, we need a paper footage and a PNG image. You can use any image you like. Let's trim the timeline to the 2 seconds for now because we have the footage for 2 seconds only. First, make sure your image is inside the green area. Uh, so, let's reduce the scale a little bit, just like this. Then, change the track mode of the footage layer to alpha mode. Now, go to effects and presets and search for key light 1.2. Then, apply it on the footage layer. Then pick the blue color from here. Nice. Now make a duplicate of the image layer by pressing Ctrl plus D. Then select these two layers and pre-compose them. You can give it a name, but let's keep it simple for now. Alright. Now place the image under the pre-compose layer and also make a copy of the pre-compose layer as well. Now change the track mode of the image layer to alpha matte with the second layer just like this and also apply the key light effect on the first layer as well then pick the green color from here after that you will see there is no image right now so let's turn on the visibility of the image layer from here and you will get the image and yeah your paper animation is done uh, for background i have a paper texture image as well you will get all the files with the project file and i will add it in the description Reduce the scale of the texture image so that it can fit inside our composition, just like this. But I need this texture to be black. And for doing that, there is an easy method. You can just apply tint effect on it. And just swap the colors from here. Alright, let's pre-compose these three layers as well. So that we can animate it later. Open position property for this. Hold Alt and click on the stopwatch icon to add an expression. Then type wiggle 2 comma 10. Now copy the expression from here as well. And open the position property of the texture layer. And apply the same expression here as well. Just like this. And for the background we can add half tone effect. And for this I have a footage for that as well. Bring it to other timeline. You can place it on the top of the all layers or maybe you can place it under your image layer as well but just make sure you change the blending mode to the overlay and turn down the opacity to 10 so that it blends with the background and also you can reduce the size of it yeah, this looks fine so this is all this is very simple and our paper texture animation is done to enhance the effect, we can add an adjustment layer here, place it on the top and apply posterized time effect on it. And change the frame rate value to 12. Now you will get a choppy feel animation inside so that we can get the stop motion animation like this. Yeah, this is all. Uh, this is very easy so this is all for today i hope you like the video thank you for watching see you guys in the next one till then have fun and stay safe